The family photos, always embarrassing. Baby Nikki with blonde hair. Me in my first power suit with a perm. And 17-year-old Nikki in the Air Force. I wanted to serve, I wanted to travel, and I wanted to be a part of something greater than myself. I was born and raised in a small town. My father has been in the mining industry now, working blue collar, very hard work for the last 45 years. And my mom spent many years as an entrepreneur. So I learned at a really young age, the value of working hard. After getting here to Davis Monthan Air Force Base, I met my husband, we fell in love, and we have three amazing kids, and there's nowhere else in the world that I wanna raise my kids. I ran into a lot of personal challenges after I got out of the Air Force. I struggled for a long time to find a good job here in the city of Tucson. And that is part of what's driving me to want to run for office so that I can help create opportunities for all of our families here in the city. As a business and technology professional, it's really important to me to make sure that we're leading the way in making sure that our workforce, our students coming out of school and out of the U of A are prepared for the next version of jobs that we're gonna have. We need to focus on supporting our small businesses, our entrepreneurs. The way she introduced politics to me actually made me go register to vote for the first time in my life. I'm 38 years old, so yeah. The moment entrepreneurs really understand like the possibilities that she's going to bring forward, our city's going to be spectacular. I hear people's concerns over public safety. I want everyone who lives in Tucson, who visits Tucson, who seeks refuge in Tucson to feel safe. And that means funding our first responders and making sure that they have the resources to be successful. I'm really excited to be able to bring my technology background to the city and help us make decisions and solve problems as we move into the future. We have a lot of opportunity to move Tucson forward as a smart city. We can do a lot of things to address reducing our carbon footprint. We definitely need to continue to focus on water conservation and how we can be smart with our water resources. I decided to get involved locally because that's really where our power lies. If everyone steps up and does what they can to make their neighborhoods better and their cities better and their communities better, this is how we're gonna change the world. We have an opportunity to make history this year, Tucson. So I'm asking for your vote in this upcoming election. Let's do this together.